Hi guys, bonjour mes amis, I'm Booger, welcome aboard. Guess what we're going to do? I haven't done it yet. Pizza. I did a pizza roll, but I didn't do pizza. So, I'll see what I got to work with and see what we got to do and let's go. This is how we do it. Chin chin. Alright. You guys ready? Okay. I have my pre-made dough here that I had in the freezer. Um, I make my own dough. I'll leave a link to uh, the recipe. It's from T. Roy Cook's Pizza Dough. I've got some flour down here. And I'm just going to... I think I'm going to separate this ball in two. Because this usually makes a... Like a 12 inch pizza. It's been sitting in the heat so it's all stretchy. So I'm going to put that in half. Make two like six inch pizzas. I'll put this aside. So let's just stretch this out. Try to make a circle. <laughs> a real pizza is not going to be a circle. Then you know it's a real pizza. Okay, you guys, this is a cake pan. I think it's a, it has to be nine inch probably. All right. So that's what I was thinking. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to spray it with some uh, olive oil. Like so. And I'm going to take my dough here. Stretch it out to fit this pan. It's not going to be pretty right now. Pizzas are never pretty at to begin with. Okay. Let's put some sauce, which is just uh, pasta sauce. It's got garlic and peppers and stuff instead of just buying pizza sauce you guys should try pasta sauce they have all kinds of good flavors out there all right I've got some parmesan in here I'm gonna all right, let me bring it closer sprinkle some of that on there first time doing pizza and air fryer this will be interesting huh <laughs> I've got some uh, mozzarella pearls can you shred it? It's okay. Whatever. It's your pizza. Make it your way. I'm going to reserve a couple of them for the top. Because I like a cheesy pizza. I does. Okay, that's good for now. Um, Let's see. Uh, I like pepperoni. I'm using the other one. I'm not putting pepperoni because the husband can't do pepperoni. So... Put that on there. Okay, so that should be good. One more. I like pepperoni. Okay. I have some uh, Canadian bacon because you know I'm Canadian, so American bacon's good too. I'm not discriminating. Bacon, any kind of bacon is good. How's that look so far? I don't know how the machine's gonna cook it. It's an experience, experiment, so let's just see how she goes. All right. All right, those are my ingredients. I'm gonna do the rest of this Parmesan on there. It's not a whole lot. Just use it up. Some of this, a little bit more here. They don't melt like, you know, shredded mozzarella. They just kind of just slowly spread out. So, how about that, you guys? Are we ready? Let's see we're going to do this right now. Let me change the angle. Bad, bad. So, there it is. And I'm just going to drop that in there. Like so. So, that way... If I just put the pizza in there without that pan, that little nub that turns the paddle would dig into the dough. So I thought about this. This is what I came up with. This is why I don't sleep. All right. So the bottom one will be on. The top one, let's do a three. Because we don't want to go crazy on that. Let's check it in a few minutes. All right. We're 10 minutes in. You want to check it out? Wee hee 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 hee. 
extreme close up. Oh my gosh, you guys! Let me check the bottom of that. Oh, we still got about 10 minutes to go. I'm going to turn it down to a 2. Because it's closer to the burner, so it's cooking faster. So we're going to slow it down just a little bit. 2 a 2. There you go. Alright, guys. This is crazy stuff. I tell you what, you guys. This is beautiful. Now, I did lower it to 1. So let's just say... I waited till all that stuff was cooked on the top and the bottom is still because it's it's not close to the bottom so I turned it to one I left the bottom on for 10 minutes so we're gonna plate this up and we'll taste okay there it is isn't that beautiful we're gonna try this Pretty surprised at how it turned out. <laughs> Smells delicious. Okay. Oh no. Let's try this one. Oh, it's still too hot. See the bottom? Not bad. Alright, here goes. Mmm. Oh yeah. The bomb.com. I'm very pleased with this. So the upside down cake pan, which is too hot for me to take out of there, but let me show you. Well, that fits perfectly. That works, you guys. Alright, thanks for shopping. Bye.